Ladies and gentlemen, this is Trainer Havoc and welcome back to another collection video. Oh man, it is overcast right now, it is getting cold, and I had a stuffed, like the right side of my nose has been stuffed, and then I had a bloody nose, just onset like that this morning. I can breathe, I'm feeling good now, I know. Kind of weird thing to talk about, but here we are, I'm excited. I'm gonna I'm probably do two collection videos back to back. One of them is a collection that has been done, but that won't be this one, because this one is the one I just finished. And you recognize these two guys, my um, my two fossil uh, theme decks here. Those are um, obviously all fossil Pokemon cards, which means that's right. We are looking at the fossil deck. I'm gonna start um, from the back and then we're gonna get more exciting here. But uh, yep, uh, this one has, uh, I think five trainers here. Yeah, um, which is very different um, from some of them, like the expansions and whatnot, only have one or two. <laughs> but yep, that's uh, that's the very last page to that sheet. Uh, let's see, let's see, how do I wanna do this? I think we start right here. Yeah, here we go. But yep, uh, so now, um, normally as you guys know, these older sets, they go from rare to common, so I thought it would be good to start on the common side of things. This one's first edition. We no will notice some of these from obviously PokeClux videos. Um, it's where I get a lot of them. And a lot of them I, I either had or know someone who had and I traded for, so. Um, show you the last one I got, which was the hardest and I ended up um, having to buy. This Magmar, always super cool. He's like probably one of the coolest Magmars of all time just because of how dark and stuff it is. These things look nice and gritty. And, just a little bit more realistic to me. Here we go, we're getting to an exciting page here. So, um, Gollum's just an uncommon, but I think at the top we'll get to some rares here. Gold Duck, these like, yeah, there are these like, these like uh, artworks, and here's our first edition, Ghastly. Um, they're a little bit more intense. They feel a little bit more real. All right, let's get to our rares. Start ending with a Zapdos here, but we got a Raichu, and then we got a Muck. Um, Turn around, we're going into the Moltres. So uh, there's one of every uh, three legendary birds in this set, which makes this set particularly awesome. Magneton's awesome as well. There's our Lapras. That Lapras was actually hard for me to find. The only Lapras I could find are holographic. Interesting enough, fighting a non holo was a little bit more challenging. Hypno, we got a hit on Lee. Uh, yeah, these cards are just, these cards are just great. Haunter. Haunter's a rare. I think that's funny. He also has a holographic. I thought that was in a base set too, but apparently it's in fossil, but we'll, we'll get to see that. Um, Gengar. I actually have a couple of these. My brother really liked Gengar, and so he had a couple, and so I was able to get to him. This was the last card I, I just got. I had to actually go on Troll and Toad and just pick it up. Um, this Dragonite here. Um, a little bit a little bit harder to find for some reason for me, but I, I don't know what that's about, but uh, we'll finish that sleep sheet. But that, it's just... But it is what it is, I guess. All right, and here we go. We're finishing off the non-hollow rares here. We got Ditto, Articuno, that last legendary bird, and you know we're seeing him. I had a couple of him, an Aerodactyl. All right, now we're going to our holographics. Here's Zapdos, probably my favorite Zapdos card as a kid. I don't see why that changed now. Um, I just love the purple and like the lightning effect in the background. The base set's really cool, but I think this one always just like, I just thought this one was just a really good Zapdos. They're both really good though. We got our Raichu. Golden boy right here. Before Raichu had that um, traditional look, I think he has now. He, it's more traditional here, but um, <laughs> they went through a few iterations. Here's our holographic muck, simple hollow, pretty easy to get my hands on. This Moltres I've had forever and ever. Um, I've just kept him nicely conditioned and sealed, and so I finally got to put him in my collection. So that's really fun. Oh, we got our Magneton here. I like this background, and I like the hollow the way it works with it. Um, and then we got a, look at all those stars on the Lapras, a simple one, all those stars. Apparently there's some without stars and that's why, you know, people collect those. I like the stars though. We got our Kabutops here, hollow Kabutops. I know this card has always been a really cool one. We got our Hypno, um, simple holographic as well. He almost, yeah, you can see a couple stars there. Um, we got our Hitmonlee. Hitmonlee's also really cool. The Kabutops and the Hitmonlee kind of share the same background. I suppose so does the Haunter and Hypno though, so what's to say? Got those two, same background right there. So there's our Haunter, there's our rare holographic, interesting enough, and then Gengar. What other person do you know gets two, like, two people in their evolution lines to get a rare like that? 
Here's Dragonite Holographic. Pretty exciting card. I can't remember what I pulled them from. Maybe it was a Poke Collector or something like that, but uh, incredible card. This one's really expensive to get a hold of too. I looked them up because uh, I thought when I was buying the non holo I was like, oh, that must be the holo. That, that's quite a bit of money. And then I looked and I was like, nope, uh, the holo one's like 20 something dollars. So glad I got that one pulled. We got our Ditto here, our Articuno from our uh, one month special. Um, I also might have just had this one. I don't know which one this one is, but I have the second one. And our Aerodactyl, which we pulled from Poke Collect as well. Uh, really, really cool um, series uh, expansion right here. I thought I would be showing you Jungle, but um, I'm still I'm still working on Jungle just a little bit. It won't be much longer, I don't think. I just need to. Um, really, really, what it is is um, I don't have theme decks for it, and I want to get the theme decks for it because uh, we got our. Oops, sorry about knocking the camera around. We got our uh, lockdown here, and our Magmar, and we got our, our bodyguard here, and these are both in really good condition. One of these, I got this for my first TCA gaming box, uh, mystery box, and I got I bought this one on eBay. So they make the they make the uh, hockey ball. All right, well that's uh, one of the collection videos I want to show you. I'm gonna go go straight into the next one. Um, you won't see it for a couple of weeks, and or this one you won't see it for a couple of weeks after I make that one, I suppose. Um, but yeah, but guys, thank you for watching. If you uh, want me to continue uh, showing you my collection, leave a like. Uh, if you like these videos, please subscribe. And um, if you guys uh, want, ever want to comment, I'll uh, be hiding those comments. And um, I'll definitely uh, want to talk to you guys. Anyway, so that's it for this one. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.